morning everybody today we are going to make mummy in english they call it conk i don't know if they call it conch or conk but i call it conk this is how it looks like this is how it comes in it comes in a little box like that usually you think the cost of this was well, the cost of that was 61 dollars but you get a lot a lot, a lot. this is how it looks like Stay tuned. And what I do, the way I clean it, it, there's not much to do in this type of meat. Because it's a big muscle, there's not much to do. So what I usually do, I cut it in, I cut it through here, and then this is how it will come out. And this is how I cut it, you see? But I cut it small because it tastes better when it's small so you can make a nice juicy sauce with it. All right, all right guys, so stay tuned. All right guys, so it is done. I'm done, I'm done cutting. And I'm done cleaning. Well, not cleaning yet, because now it's time for me to. I wanted to show you guys how I clean it. So I, as you can see, I didn't do all of the box. Here's the rest of the box. What's in the box? I put it back in my little Ziploc bag. So for another for another day. All right. So now here I cut some lemons. Okay. I'm gonna clean it, squeeze it, and clean it with it. Okay. they usually um, they usually uh, beat the lumbi so it can be a little bit softer I don't need to do all of that it's too much work um, and some people that I heard that clean it with soap I don't know why maybe it's to, to take off the 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 I guess to take off the um, the seafood uh, taste to it but it is seafood it, it's supposed to smell like seafood it's supposed to basically uh, tastes like seafood you know so you just as long as you clean it well with lemon and um, lemon and what's there it's um, um, vinegar okay so since I'm holding the camera it's hard for me to use both my hands Don't put any salt because if you put salt, it will um, make the um, the muscle harder. You don't want that. Okay. All right. So now I'm gonna soak this. Guys, I love Lumbi. I love, love, love Lumbi. You can make Lumbi with as a salad or as a sauce or um, anything seafood. I'm, I love. I can eat fish every day. Every day. Now, if it fell here, don't worry, guys, because my sink is always disinfected. And. Um, and plus, I am going to clean the, the muscle again, so it's okay. Okay, so let's do another. I'm going to use the other three. All right, guys, so you see one part of it, okay? Alright guys, so now I am done with the cleaning part. This is, um, it's in my pressure cooker. I'm going to put garlic, minced garlic that, that I have in here. Okay, so I'm going to mix it. Excuse my little spoon. the smell of garlic guys garlic is so good 
a lot of um, Caribbean people, they love to cook with garlic. Garlic's, garlic is not only good to make the food taste good, but it's good for other things as well. So if you taste a lot of, taste the garlic in some, some of um, Caribbean um, food, it's okay. It's really good. Well, it's good for me, excuse me. <laughs> All right. So now we're gonna add some water. By now you guys should know this cup. This is my cup of water. <laughs> I do everything in this cup. Not everything, but I, I like to use it for water, to use water whenever I'm cooking. But it's my husband's cup. That's why he, he liked to drink his, um, he liked to drink his uh, um, water or anything in there. Okay, so this is enough, this is enough water for me. All right, so now, Let's bring it to the stew. So I'm gonna close it like this. As you guys can see, I didn't add anything else. I did not add, actually I forgot to add oil. This is olive oil, guys. Okay. And that's it. Oil with garlic, with water, and that's it. All right. All right, guys. So it is done. Here's how the lummy look. How the conk look. You see, it's already cooked. You see? All right. So now the water that's there, I am not gonna throw it away because the water that I need the water to make my sauce. Okay. So now let's turn on the stove. Let's add some oil here. Now I'm gonna make my sauce, guys. Yeah, that's should be okay. Now, the ingredients, here's my lumbi, and I forgot to let you guys know that I'll be adding crab. So my crab is already clean. There it is. Nice and clean, you see? Yeah, and I cut it in half. And then, um, this is what I would be using. <laughs> Every time I, wa I see this, I don't want you guys to think that it is ricotta cheese. It's not, okay? It's um, tomato paste. <laughs> okay, and then this is my A piece. And then I'm gonna be using my flambo. My flambo sauce, mantux. And jerk jerk um, seasoning. That's, that's a Jamaican seasoning, I like this. It's really good. And of course, I'm gonna use the lemon, um, lemon juice. I need to have that little hump of my food and then I'm gonna be using and then these are the ingredients I'm gonna be adding afterwards okay all right guys so let's wait till this is nicely hot okay all right, guys let me show you how it looks like now A nice color I already put my tomato paste, I already put my apis in there. Okay. So now I just added the water from when I had boiled the, um, the lumbi. Okay, so now let's let it simmer a little bit and then taste and see what it needs for taste. I am not gonna add the crab yet. I am gonna add it soon because I want it to boil with the, um, the lumbi. But first, let's make 
sure that um, the lavi tastes good, okay? All right, guys. I already added the crab already in there. As you can see, I already changed color. Guys, it smells so good. So let's see what it needs. Let's just let it simmer a little bit more before we add everything else, okay? Okay, guys, so it should be almost done now. Look at it. Look how beautiful it is. The sauce is nice and red. I also hate we call it sauce. But um, I believe American, they like to call it, um, what, broth or? There it is. Okay. So now, oops. I can taste the wine. I can taste the um, the flavor, different flavor into the sauce. It tastes so, 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 so good, guys. Now, since it's almost, since it's done, basically it's done. So now, let me just add the remaining of this onions, like this. Okay. I know it's a lot of onions, but I love onions, okay? <laughs> I love onions. Okay. Yes. So now this is done. Put the lid back on. Just let it crack open a little bit. And then let me put this down up to four. And just let it do his magic and it's done. Alright? So this is how I make my lumbi, and I'll show you how you guys can um, eat it with. You guys can eat it with rice. You can eat it with um, any type of rice you want. You can eat it with boiled plantain. You can eat it with a sat a side of salad on, on the side or a side of a uh, um, chopped cabbage on the side. I mean, anything that you guys want to eat it with. Okay, all right. Thanks again, guys, for watching my channel. And please remember to subscribe, like, and comment. All right, guys. Bye. Bisous.